So we're in Dollar Tree finding the best scores right now for the end of February going into March. You won't believe what I found. Pantry stickers, you guys. There's so many different ones to choose from. And there's 75 to 157 labels in each pack. So you got your labels, come to the glass section of Dollar Tree. They have so many glass containers you can use with the labels for your dry goods. I'm so excited about this. This is the pack I like the most. It is 157 pre-made labels. The font is kind of like that Ray Dunn font. So I put some of these labels on top of these glass containers from Dollar Tree, and I really like the way that it looks. Then this next pack, there's 51 labels in this pack and then 24 blank labels. That's 75 labels total. I like the way that these ones look the best. However, you're not getting as many pre-made labels. This pack has 120 labels. 96 of the labels are pre-made labels. And then the other 24 labels are ones where you could write over them with the chalk marker. No matter what pack you can find, I like all three of them. I just prefer the first one the most. Let me know which one you prefer. One, two, or three. I have not seen this before at Dollar Tree. These stand-up reusable food storage bags. So it kind of looks like it was a closeout a different brand that's not Dollar Tree. I definitely want to give these a try. I ended up giving these a try. They zip up really nicely. They are a food safe material. They're leak free, BPA and lead free. So if you're looking for an option that you could reuse, you can definitely buy a pack of these from Dollar Tree, see if you like them, and then go back for more if you want more. Dollar Tree's carried the bamboo boards before, but they're bringing them back in and you can do amazing things with this more than just cutting on top of them. You can make personal charcuterie boards for people, or you can even use a wood burner and burn right on top of this. So it's the day after Valentine's Day and right now you're gonna find a bunch of Easter. For instance, they got table runners, three feet. You're gonna need at least probably two of these for most of the tables, but this is a new find and they have really pretty ones. Right now you can get these ice cube trays. These are great to use with candles from Dollar Tree to make wax melts. I love these little gumball machines. They had these for Valentine's Day. They have them for Christmas and this is the first time they have them for Easter. They have an egg and a bunny. You can get these egg containers. They're great for Easter gift baskets or DIYing. I'm gonna buy a few to see what I can make with these. I've never seen these before carrots but these carrots they're like realistic looking i don't know if this is worth a dollar 25 cents however the art always is my favorite new pieces i love these farmhouse looking ones this egg they got a carrot one then these are really awesome it's new rugs and they have a bunch of different ones to choose from oh they're so cute this is new to Dollar Tree. I really like these pieces. They have like a farmhouse style. They remind me of like Kirkland type of thing that you can buy. I want to get a few of these. They got gnomes. If you love gnomes, they got them. I don't know what Dollar Tree's obsession with gnomes is, but there you go, gnomes. These gnome plushies are super, super cute. And then they bring these in all the time, every single year. These bunnies are such a score for the price. I love this. So during Christmas time, Dollar Tree had these gingerbread cookie making kits and they brought out some for Easter time. I want to try these. The icing in these cookie kits isn't the best, but this is a fun activity to do with your children, especially when the holiday seasons come up. So they got like belts in, but look at these belts. These scream like Avril Lavigne in the early 2000s or like Lizzie McGuire. Like look at that. This is like Lisa Frank right here. Just off the side of the belts, we got bucket hats, tie-dye bucket hats. What the heck? And then to the side of all that, there's wristbands. This screams Apple Levine. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about with the wristbands and those belts. Dollar Tree's just asking for it now. Look at these socks. I'm going to buy this and I'm going to dress up like Avril Levine. I look ridiculous. This totally would have been something I would have been into back in the day. Oh, my butterfly's falling off of my hair. The bucket hat did not fit, so then I put the butterfly clips inside of my hair. Um, 
but now I just look crazy, especially since I've got my pregnancy belly going on. I just look like I'm trying to relive my youth before the baby comes. I look phony. This video is sponsored by Fetch, and I'm gonna share with you guys how you can scan your Dollar Tree receipts to get free rewards. Listen, when you're done shopping at Dollar Tree, do not toss the receipt. I always scan my receipts using the Fetch app. If you're into saving money, you need to download the Fetch app. It's an easy to use, 100% free app where you earn free rewards on literally anything you buy. You just snap photos of your receipts and upload them for points. You can then use those points to redeem for rewards. Fetch works with literally any retail receipt from anywhere, e-receipt, physical receipts. Even if you have receipts that are up to two weeks old, you can scan them and start earning points. You can truly scan any receipt in a matter of seconds. It's so easy. You can even link up your Amazon account to get points fast, which is amazing if you're an avid Amazon shopper like me. You can start redeeming points at 5,000 points. It's a simple process. Your rewards then turn into gift cards. There's gift cards for so many stores like Target and restaurants like Olive Garden. There's even gift cards for online stores like Amazon. They even have special offers where you get even more points for buying from specific brands. Just check out the Discover page and look at the special offers. If you would like to try Fetch for yourself, remember it's totally free. Check out the link in the description. Use the code Bethany and get 5,000 points when you scan your first receipt. It's really that easy. Thanks again to Fetch for sponsoring this video. I've been looking for this forever. I bought it before. I need another one. It's this microfiber fan duster. You can attach it to one of the Dollar Tree broomsticks so you can reach high, hard to get places, but these are great. Then they got rubber brooms in. I want to try this on my carpet. I love anything that gets dog hair out of the carpet, and I feel like this might do a good job, especially because there's this squeegee portion on this. This is new, and I want to try it out. When we vacuum our rugs, our vacuum doesn't do a good job of removing all of my dog's hair, and it's hard to tell that the hair is even there, so I like to use things like this to remove dog hair. Now, I have some gloves on because I was picking up the hair to show you just how much it pulled out of the rug. However, normally after I have scooped it all up, I do go in with a vacuum on that particular spot because just pulling it off with your hands is not going to do the trick. So Dollar Tree always has these dust pans that you can buy and it's the kind that you just stand up straight and hold by the handle. They recently got these ones in so that they're a little bit of a better quality, a little bit bigger. I'm actually gonna get this because oh, I'm so out of bed breath bending. So Dollar Tree is bringing all their spring stuff in. They got planters and I like these ones. They look like they're concrete. The stackable ones are my favorite. These ones are actually great for DIYing for the spring season. You can make barrels out of these. There's quite a few of them that I want to buy right now. I just got to choose my favorites. Oh, and then the stackable ones. These are awesome for the price. They're bringing in all of their crafting items. The wood beads are amazing. They got the wood bead garland. They bring that out every single year, but it's one of the best buys you can get at Dollar Tree. There's also these wood cutouts. They got big ones, the felt. There's so much to choose from. Oh, look it, and there's little peep. What is this? Peep bath bombs. I'm gonna get peep bath bombs. That's gonna be fun. And then they got some eggs. You can buy a bunch of these for $1.25 and put them in your house. And everybody's gonna think you're rich because eggs are a lot of money right now. Dollar Tree right now is getting a bunch of new wall art in. They have this all the time, but they bring out new releases with a whole lot of new images. And I really like the more modern graphic style of wall art. It reminds me of stuff you buy at like Home Goods. You can always attach a bunch of them together to get a bigger piece, or you can use some wood pieces from Dollar Tree to create a frame. If you're gluing multiple canvases together, I recommend flipping the canvases over after you've glued them all together, and then use something like popsicles to glue wherever two canvases meet. And this helps this piece become more secure and more like one whole piece versus six separate pieces that you have attached. This is how it looks vertically, and then I also show it horizontally and let me tell you guys, what you see on camera isn't always how it is behind the camera. Like I'm trying to film this and in the meantime, my kid and the dogs were going crazy. Dollar Tree has those little like ice spears. I think that's what it's called. But this is like individual ones. I want to give this a try, see if it works. And I think I want to use some of that edible glitter inside of this to see if I can make my water 
sparkle. I ended up trying edible glitter when I was making the ice cubes. I don't know if I put too much glitter or if I didn't do this right. I read that you're supposed to pour boiling hot water inside of this when you're doing the edible glitter so that you don't get a cloudy look to your ice cubes. However, my ice cubes ended up looking like egg yolk. It didn't look right, but when you put the water on top of it and the ice starts to melt, the water turned all glittery and sparkly. I also did some ice cubes or ice balls, whatever you want to call them, using regular water. This is how they look. They do a really good job of keeping your drinks cool. This is new to Dollar Tree. I got one on the way, as you guys know. And look at, they have like nursery decor. Look, hello little one, twinkle, twinkle. This one's, I think, a boss baby, sweet dreams. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Be, be brave. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. You can make a like nice little um, gift basket for somebody expecting. Look, hello world, name, date. I don't have a name for my baby quite yet, but I'm gonna get this because I know this will come in handy when I actually have her. Look at these girl balloons. Those are great for baby shower or sprinkle, this cake topper. And then they have the same equivalent for boys. So there's a boy balloon. I don't see the cake topper, but this is awesome. They even have these star wooden hooks that you can use inside of a nursery to hang something off of, like maybe a blanket or some little clothes. I'm sure you can hang like a net, a little like mesh bag from Dollar Tree as well off of these and then put toys inside of that. Oh my gosh, you guys, I love Dollar Tree party decor. I have bought so many pieces for different parties throughout my life. I've never seen this. It is these balloon stands. Look it, it comes with the stick you need to put the balloon on, but the stands, they're just little clouds. This is awesome. This is perfect for, again, a baby shower or just any type of thing. Oh. I'm gonna get a few of these. These balloon stakes come with this little piece that you wrap the bottom of your balloon around. Then you take the stick, push it in that smaller piece, and then push the stick inside of the base. That looks like a cloud to me, but honestly, I think it's supposed to be a flower. So I ended up doing this to three balloons. I did cut the stick a little bit off of one of the balloons so I could add height. That's definitely something you could try out. Now these are very lightweight, so I recommend getting some balloon glue dots from Dollar Tree and placing them on the bottom of the base that way it doesn't topple over easily on you. This is a ripoff. What is this Dollar Tree? I'm gonna spend a dollar and 25 cents on this. Look, when I could get this. What, what? Make this make sense. So Dollar Tree keeps bringing in new DIY wood crafts. Oh my gosh, and they're so good. But these ones, I haven't seen quite yet. And what I like about this is I can make three different art pieces for a dollar and 25 cents. I'm gonna get this. I think this is gonna be great to DIY with. I ended up taking one of these home. I cut it into three separate pieces. Then I used the new farmhouse stencils from Dollar Tree right on top of this. It's the perfect size. All you have to do is get a paint sponge, dip it into some paint, and then stipple the paint right on top of the stencil. Once you remove the stencil, you got a piece that is ready to go. You can clean the stencil and reuse it for some other projects. This is something Dollar Tree normally carries. However, they're starting to bring them back in and you can find them, all the stores near me have them. It is these almost acrylic looking containers that are great for bathroom organization, vanity organization. These are great inside of junk drawers or inside of a desk. I highly recommend these. In the spring section of Dollar Tree right now, you're able to find some decorative knobs. I bought a couple of them and I used wire cutters to get rid of the screw. This takes a little bit of work until I was able to get the screw off and once I had it off I decided to glue the knob to my containers I did flip it over and glue it to the underside of the container just because I like the way that that looked better than gluing it to the top however you can do it whichever way you like and this is an easy way to really glam up these pieces I love the way that it looks one of my favorite things to buy from Dollar Tree are the wall mount wire racks. They're always in white. However, right now, look, you can find them in black and in silver. You guys, you can do so many nice things with these. You just buy them as is, hang up some mugs right off of them. You can stack these on top of them or each other and make like a bigger mug rack. I've used these so many times on my channel. Highly recommend. Okay, Dollar Tree has not had fake fruit in forever you guys i love to diy wood you guys know me i love fake sweets on this channel i love using fake fruits especially like apples during the holiday season um, like fall and halloween and then they have these picks these are great for summer spring like i've done 
candied apples with these and then like the poison apples from Dollar Tree. Oh, I'm so excited about this. So Dollar Tree is getting in a bunch of DIY wood pieces. I've shared some with, already with you guys. There's like farmhouse wood bead garland. Look at this one though. This is a wreath already done for you. Usually you just get the wreath form, nothing else. Look, $1.25, perfect, already to go. This monogram garland would pair really, really nicely with that wreath. So Dollar Tree has their new spring collection in and look how beautiful these pieces are. They have these butterfly hooks. I like these flower hooks right here. These welcome signs. They kind of have like the shabby chic look to them. Ooh, look at this one. Some really pretty pieces in this collection. I recently shared this in an organizing video. Dollar Tree got in these hand soaps, but what I like about them is the container. It has that like farmhouse look to it and you can take these labels off, put a different one to make it look more high end. I think this might've been for like the holiday collection and they're just recently getting it in or maybe some, whoever the supplier is, or just like they didn't sell through it because it's pumpkin spice vanilla cookies and spiced apples. So you can always take this soap out and then replenish it with something else that makes a little bit more sense for the spring and summertime. Again, you know me, I love fake sweets and all that. Look at these little little uh, bath sponges. They look like popsicles. Look at these quality socks. They're thick and they retailed for $20 once upon a time. I found these press on nails at Dollar Tree. They look like they're a really good deal. They're really nice and they do come with glue. I've only tried press on nails a few times in my life. I like the way that they look. It's just, I, I am very low maintenance when it comes to my nails because I DIY so much that like it just breaks off really easily. But I wanted to share this with you guys because I do think it's a great vibe. Anyways, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, thanks to Fetch for sponsoring and thank you so much for always supporting this channel, you guys, and you know, taking the time out of your day to watch me. I will see you next time. Take care, bye.